In this video, you will learn step-by-step -step how to use TradingView as a beginner. Whether crypto, forex or stocks, TradingView is currently the best charting software in the world, which is exactly why I use it every single day for my analysis for all of my crypto trades. Step one, go to tradingview.com click on get started which is on the top right now as a beginner I recommend you use the free version which is perfectly enough but if you want later on you can get the plus or the premium version which is what I have because number one you get many more indicators and the most important feature is the bar replay which means you can backtest all of your strategies but for right now click on sign up you can either use Google or you can even use Facebook I will just use my email next fill the capture click create account now you have to verify your email, so check your email, activate account, now click accept, and then next. Next, we will get the desktop app because the desktop app is way nicer and cleaner to use. So just simply go to more right here and then go to downloads and then go to desktop app. Then choose your operating system. I have a Mac, so I will choose this one right here. So this here is the TradingView desktop app. First of all, I recommend you do three things. The first thing is you can customize your background. Now, I personally, I prefer a dark background, but if you want, you can go right here on the top left, color theme, and you can have a light background. Like I said, the dark one is way nicer, so we keep it at the dark one. The second thing you want to do is I will delete the volume by just clicking on it and then delete. This makes the chart look cleaner with less clutter. The third thing that you want to do is we will change actually the candle colors because right now the candles, red and green are very emotionally triggering colors and emotions are very bad for trading. So you have two options. Just make a right click and then you go to settings right here or the second option, you go to this settings icon here and then here you can change the color. So for example, instead of green, I will choose a yellow and instead of red, we will choose a nice gray and then we click OK. So now this looks way nicer. The next thing is on the top left are three very important things. The first and most important part is actually this one right here. If you want to look up a crypto or a forex pair or a stock, you can do it right here. So for example, Bitcoin, I trade on BitGet. That's why we will use the BitGet chart. Here we go. Now we see the Bitcoin chart. Let's say we look for Ethereum, then we click here, we type in Ethereum, and then for example, the spot price, there's also a futures price, but here's the spot price. Now we see the spot chart of Ethereum. The next important part is right here. Here, you can change the time frame. So as you can see, every single candle is representing one time frame. So for example, right now, we are on the one hour chart. This means that every candle represents one hour of price action. If you want to see, for example, the one minute chart, you go on the one minute and as you can see, the candles are way smaller. So first of all, you have to make them bigger by just going to here. You can just stretch them out like this and boom, you see the candles bigger. If you want to do swing trades, usually the one hour is very, very nice. Or you can also look at the one day and you can also put them as a favorite right here, here, here and here. So in the future, you have them side by side. Next, we have the indicator section, which is right here. Here, you can search for any indicators you want. Indicators basically help you to analyze the chart and to make better trading decisions. Now, there are many, many different indicators, but one of the basic indicators is, for example, the simple moving average. So you just type in SMA and you can see here, moving average simple. So we click on it. Now, this here is our first indicator. This indicator is showing up on the main chart, but some indicators show, for example, on the bottom. So let's go to RSI. Let's click on it. And now we will see the indicator show on the bottom. The next thing which is really helpful is you can actually customize them. So for example, we go to this indicator SMA, which is this line right here. And we click on this small settings icon. You can change, for example, the length, for example, to 200 and also the style. I like to usually make it in a brighter color and also a bit thicker. Then we click OK. If you want to hide this indicator, just simply click on the eye icon and you can make it disappear. Same thing with here. You can click the eye icon 
and it's going away. One optional thing is you can click right here and you can change the candle type. All of these candle types are very advanced, so I will cover them in a separate video. Here, you can make an alert. This is very, very helpful, so I will also make a separate video. In the first week of January, I will take 50 complete beginner traders to an intermediate level in just seven days. If you want to be one of those 50 people, you can apply below. Now, we come to the most important feature, which is the replay feature. You can use this one, for example, to play back in time and to back test your strategy. It's very, very helpful. If you want, you can also have two screens at the same time. So for example, right here, you can have Ethereum on the left and on the right, for example, Bitcoin. So here we have Bitcoin and here we have Ethereum. Right here, you can save the whole template. We can give this a name, Bitcoin trading. Then we click save. And then next time you can load a certain template. So for example, this one, is my main template, but we will jump back to this one. Now you know all the important parts on the top left. Here you have all the tools. So the tools help you to analyze the chart. For example, right here you see all the trend lines, different trend lines. I like to use the simple trend line, which is this one. And you can also put this as a favorite and then it will show up right here. So next time you can just click here and draw a trend line like this. One below, we have all the Fibonacci tools. This is very advanced, but very, very helpful. So I will make a separate video about this, how to use this to your advantage. One below, we have all the patterns. Also, in my opinion, you don't need them for the beginning. The next one below is very helpful. I will also mark them in my favorites. This here is a tool where you can draw a long position. So for example, this would be your stop loss, which you can set hypothetically, and this would be your take profit. And this here would be your entry. So for example, let's say I will go long now, I will place my envelope and then simply wait. And then you can see if it was a profit or a loss. The same thing for here, you can draw a short position. Let's delete this one. In the middle line is your entry. Here is your stop loss. And here would be your take profit. Next, we have the brush tool. Here you can draw anything you want. You can highlight things. You can draw manually a line, for example, whatever you want to draw. As you can see, we are using the brush tool now. If you want to go back, just simply go to here and you will have the normal cross. And also very helpful, the rectangle. So the rectangle is very helpful for drawing your support and resistance line. For example, right here, I will draw a support line because we can see the price bounced multiple times. On the other hand, I will draw a resistance line right here because here you can see that the price has been pushed down one, two, three times. Next, we have the text tool right here. Here, you can click on there and then you can type something for example, a note, review later. If you saw something interesting, you can put a note here and check it later. One below, you can use emojis. Next, we have here the measure tool. This one is also very important. You simply click on it and you can measure two things. The first thing is you can measure the price move. So for example, from here to here, you can see the price increased by 0.29% and you can see it's over five bars, AKA five minutes. Why five minutes? Because we are on the one minute chart, which means every candle is one minute. Let's measure, for example, from this top to this bottom, we can see it took nine minutes to reach this price and the price fell by minus 0.51%. And also on the bottom, you can see the time. So for example, here, you can see it's 4.30 a.m. in the morning. And here, of course, you can see the price of the asset. So we are looking at Ethereum and you can see the price right now is $2,303. Here, you can lock your view. So if you wanna prevent anyone from changing anything, just click this one. Here, you can make everything invisible and then visible. And here, if you want, you can remove all drawings. And if you did this by accident, you can click right here and you can make them visible again. One amazing feature of TradingView, on the top right, you can click right here and you can build your own watch list. This means you can have multiple crypto assets here or any asset you want to invest in. Let's, for example, add Dogecoin to our watch list because the meme season is coming soon. As you can see here too, one is the spot price and one is the futures price. I will explain this in a separate video, but we will use the spot price. And then you can switch forth and back from asset to asset and also you can mark them. So for example, Bitcoin, you can make it yellow. On this left side are many other things you can explore. For example, here you have the alert section, all of the alerts that you created right here. If you wanna hide the watch list, just simply click here again. On this side, you have many other things. In my advanced video, I will also show you how you can use all the other things here 
and all the other tools in detail. Next, you need to learn how to professionally do technical analysis to make your trading decisions. Comment your questions, I will answer every single comment. If you learned something, like the video, subscribe and turn on the ring bell. I can't wait to see you in my next video. Peace.